Good morning, my name is David Lane. I'm with Bulldog Rooter. Today's date is April 7th, 2019. This is going to be an upload video. And it's going to be a video inspection of the main line of 1419 West Bellwood Drive um, here in Spokane, Washington. It also, this line shares the line with 1411 West Bellwood Drive. Um, what we're looking at here is a it's actually like a private sewer system here. Um, no permits to be found. Um, they have a they uh, eventually this eventually goes to the lift station, but we're working right from right out in the street from Bellwood. As far as I can tell, it's where the manhole is. You'll always be able to tell where the bottom of the pipe is by where my camera light is, by where the little bits of water are. We're pulling into what looks like to me this could definitely be eight inch. It's at least six inch. Could be eight inch. Uh, concrete pipe. It's big. Uh, bigger than normal. And uh, uh, like I said, you'll always be able to tell where the bottom of the pipe is by where my camera light is, by where the bits, little bits of water are. We, as we continue, start to pull back here, we are in the shared line of 1411 and 1419. Eventually we're going to transition right out of this large uh, line and into the uh, solely 1419's line. I um, called out today for a uh, mainline blockage. Um, found a soft blockage inside the home, right where a couple of the mainlines tie in together before they leave the home, and was able to clear the line. Then found a, a pretty large root intrusion um, in solely 1419's uh, line, and was able to clear that uh, thoroughly. And very happy with the work performed today. Um, we're going to give you footage coming back from the uh, sewer. We're just now passing 21 feet, and we should be tying into. Excuse me. There we are. And here we're coming solely into 1419s. And when we flushed the toilet in uh, 1411, it came rushing by. Um, and it would be going from left to right because our pipe is upside down. And here we transition um, from concrete into clay tile pipe. So the most problematic areas for tile pipe are the joints. Just over time, the ground settles, the pipes shift and offset, and they create perfect pathways for roots. Um, this main line is pretty darn, in pretty darn good shape for the age of it, if I do say so myself. Have a bit of an offset here, but because of the uh, grade, it's um, not, not too much of a problem at all, no standing water. And the very next joint here, this one and then this one are the ones where we had some roots. Uh, I was able to, I was lucky enough to able to show the uh, root intrusion to the customers before and this is going to be a great after. The pipe uh, was overgrown with roots and now they're cut flush with the pipe which is ideal. And we are just now passing 38 feet from the city sewer, excuse me, from the sewer. It's actually not the city sewer. Here we transition from tile pipe to cast iron. Cast iron normally stubs out from the house three to five feet. What we're looking at now, for now, is these tie-ins right here. Um, this is where our, our uh, one of our main lines downstairs ties in. Um, and this is right around where the blockage was. The blockage was right, right in this area, right here. We were able to clear it out completely, which was good. There was so much water built behind it that once you poke the hole in it, it almost just invariably washed all the, the, the uh, you know, soft blockage, it washed it out due to the water pressure behind it. Um, just passing 56 feet, 57. Getting ready to come up this clean out here shortly. Here we 
we are coming up our clean out now. And there's the clean out we're working out of. There's uh, our floor drain. And here's our wall right here. Again, my name is David. I'm with Bulldog Rooter. Today's date is April 7, 2019, and that's going to conclude your video inspection of the main line of 1419 as well as 1411 West Bellwood Drive here in uh, Spokane, Washington. Thank you very much for choosing Bulldog Rooter.